Hi guys, this is uh, just a quick update. Sorry I haven't been posting much on Facebook um, the last couple of weeks, but we're in a beautiful country called Australia and just don't have time. We're cycling and uh, enjoying the countryside. So I will update everything when I get back. Let's just give you guys an update. Uh, what's been happening is we've been on the road for about 15 days. Um, amazing country really amazing country some of the most friendliest people i've ever met we're, we've only camped maybe eight days out of the 15 uh 15 days basically the reason why is that every time we stop to stock up on food at coles or woolworths i think it's called uh people stop and go hey what are you called come and stay in our place tonight you know so very very friendly a couple of times we've been pulled over and we uh, got dragged back and have some steak and some beers and stuff. So love the country, really love the country. So this is just a quick update um, regarding the solar panel I got a couple of months back. So far, I have not plugged in, not even when we stayed in people's houses, I have not plugged in and powering everything by this little $50, $49 uh, solar panel. Um, what I'm doing now is I'm charging my Nog light. I done about by two hours last night and started this morning about an hour ago. So in probably another hour, I'll have this 5,000 milliamp fully charged, maybe an hour and a half. So this little thing has been amazing. Um, even on a cloudy day, as you can see, it's still dragging some part. So, what I've been using is basically anchor battery. So I've got my anchor battery, the 26,000. I'm about half full. I have charged it up, spent a day and a half charging it up, uh, about four, four days, five days ago, and I run off that. I have an additional battery underneath here. You can see there, it's a waterproof one. Um, that is fully charged. Um, my phone is fully charged. My GoPros are fully charged um, and the drones fully charged. So we've just spent the night in this beautiful park. Um, they're they're everywhere. We're in a place called Burnbury. Burnbury, I think it's called. So there's these parks. You're not supposed to camp in them, but you know, we just pull in and went behind the bushes. The tents are behind there at the moment. Just bringing in everything over here. Beautiful parks everywhere. This is called Swamp. I think this one's called Swamp. Um, beautiful swamp down there. Amazing birds. So, just gives you guys an update. Um, solar panels doing its job. Um, and uh, the new pedals. Interesting, I have to say. Interesting, still trying to get used to them. But there is a difference. I can feel the difference once you hit that sweet spot. It's just getting in the habit of positioning your foot so um, and using the MSR for my sleep system and Alpen kit this is the 200 it's part of my race system and the air mattress um, Noom, Noom or something like that. Um, well I'll do a review on that there later on um, I'll, I'll say I need more time on them so the back's looking good no problem thanks to Brian in Perth he respoked everything for me, balanced the wheels, and a little tip, which I did not know, guys. If you, I changed all these. All these are changed um, because of corrosion. Um, the material they use in most spokes causes corrosion. These stop the corrosion. So when we pulled them apart, you could see all the corrosion. These and he replaced all the the tips with these. Okay, so thank you, Brian, for doing that, and. Getting ready for the next part of the leg. Thanks a lot, guys.